Hi there, it's Ian from Do It Outdoors. Uh, it's very wet and cold outside, that's why I'm indoors today. This is my very large TP lit by my uh, super fantastic North Star Lantern from Coleman. Petrol driven, lasts for hours. So we're going to do the hobo stove today. Uh, so what we need for this are three bits, three sticks, same length as best. This thickness is, is, is more than ideal, they don't have to be as robust looking as this. However, it will give it a wee bit more stiffness. Uh, we need a pot, a tin of bean, sort of similar to that of a large tin of beans. It could have been peas, whatever. Uh, we need a nail and we need bit of wire so that's kind of bent into a, a C shape and it's quite a strong bit of wire actually um, is it strong enough I'm not sure um, you could use a coat hanger that would definitely be strong enough but uh, so I've bent it into a nice wee C shape so I'll just leave that there and what else do I need I need a little bit of cord so this is Lengthwise, I've just checked this, so it's uh, it is the length of my arm, which doesn't help you very much, but um, maybe it's about just under a meter. And of course, we need a pot because it is a tripod we're making for a pot stand. It's going to be an adjustable pot stand, so make sure you've got a pot that's got a a nice hanger on it. Oh, make your own. We can cover that another time. First off, get your pot, uh, get your nail, put your pot on something firm, get your nail, put it on the top, whack it with a hammer a few times and give it a good, a good wiggle about so you make the hole big enough for your bit of cord to go through. Okay, so we'll just show you, this was pre-done, okay, you can just see the hole through there. Get your three poles, put them together, pot right over the top, spread the legs, we'll get going. So there we are, nice firm base, it's not going anywhere, super fast. Uh, what we're going to do now is we're going to get our uh, cord, uh, and you'll see the cord here is frayed, so it's best to give it a. I can do this on my stool, on my North Star lantern. I can just put that on the top there, and it'll uh, it'll melt the the ends together, uh, and and make sure it doesn't fray anymore. There we are, just smoking away. So that's perfect. Okay, now it'll go down there. Just poke it down. Keep poking it down. Keep going. Keep going until it comes out the bottom and you'll see it's coming out. Okay, there we go. Little party trick. So, pot's going to be attached to this end and we're going to have our spare stick attached to the other end. Now, um, this is what's going to make it adjustable. So we need to tie the bit of rope onto this bit of wood. Now we need a non-slip knot. This happens to be a cool fish, but hey, we'll just uh, just tie any knot that uh, holds. We can worry about knots later. Okay, so that's there. Yeah, that's nice and that's not coming off now. He says. Okay, so now we need our hook, which there's the bit of wire which was bent into a C shape. Like I say, I'm not sure if this is strong enough. In fact, I severely doubt it. I have made a, another one here, which I know is strong enough. Um, which is a bit of a gardening wire doubled over and bent into a C. So we shall use, well we'll just use this one because it's a wee bit, wee bit more visible. So I'll just tie the end on here, figure of eight, we'll hold it. Okay, so we now have a wee hook, we have our pot, 
and we put the other end of the hook on to it and it'll hit the ground at the moment but if I if I roll this up now roll it up like this and you should start to see the pot rising pot rises all the way up all the way up okay so that's as high as it goes and of course um, if your beans aren't uh, cooking well we can just lower it back down and lift it back up super smashing great it's looking